Get in here! All right, face off against Kieran. Now, where is he going to be lurking? I guess he may not be in the terrarium. Not Kitakami though. Hold on, is he down here? There he is. Are you Pokemon Center? No, you're plot. Whoops. Hey, yo, Rising. Ready to sign up for your official match? You're Rising, yes? Let me give you your championship match setup. This will just take a moment. So, Rising, you said you and Kieran are friends, right? Well, Florida has kind of been being an asshat lately. No need to be shy about it. Friend drama is just a part of life at your age. Here's the Dracer take. I liked Kieran better when his hair was down. I agree. He used to be this quiet little guy, trembled like a leaf, had all the spine of a wimpod. He'd hide behind Carmine if you so much as breathe too loud. And I tell you what, when it came to Pokemon battling, I never saw so much joy in anyone's eyes as his. But then out of nowhere, he changed. Now he's relentless. Pushes himself, pushes everyone around him. Nothing good's gonna come from this. Someone's gotta snap him out of it. I tried but couldn't do it. Guess I've got sopped from this lazy life. So now I guess it falls on you. Sorry, bud. Sorry to keep you waiting. Everything's ready. Are you ready about Kieran, the BB League champion? No, I'd like to heal my Pokemon. Please come back when you're ready. Drayden, do you have anything else to say? If I was asked what Kieran in the League Club is up to you. Yeah, no pressure, right? Can I not heal my Pokemon out here? Like... Where do you want to go? Uh, I guess my dorm room. I guess that's where I'm gonna have to heal. Should've healed before I left, I guess. At least this room is good for something. I've used it precisely one time. Oh yeah, Ogre Pond. <laughs> that's right. I forgot we were gonna mess with his head. Alright, where is Ogre Pond? Where did I put that thing? There you are, Ogre Pond. All right, so who do I replace? That's the question. It feels rough to leave someone behind just for the memes. If I'm being honest, Miss Magius probably does like the least help, which is really too bad because I like Miss Magius just as a Pokemon. But I think this is what must be done. Sorry, Miss Magius, I love you, but the memes must be had. All right. Oh yeah, and for the peace to resistance. Sure. There. <laughs> now that we have Ogre Pond dug out from the box, make him upsetty spaghetti at me. Understood. Your champion match will begin soon. Please make sure you are ready. Well, it's all up to you now, Rising. Me and the other Elite Four, me and the other Elite Three, will be cheering for you. This is an official BB League announcement. A champion match is about to begin at the battle court near the entrance to the academy. If you'd like to watch the match, please make your way there. I mean, just like Drayden said, I like hearing better when his hair was down. Kept me waiting. I worked so hard for a chance to show you what I could really do, Rising. I put everything to study and making my Pokemon stronger. I crushed the Elite Four and became champion. All that hard work. All of it. All of it was just so that I could beat you right here, right now.
Wow. Dragonite and Polytoad. I know I'm making the right choice. You'll understand that soon enough. You've got some nerve. Bring out the ogre now at all times! That's all I wanted to do, was just make him sad. Alright. Ah, wowzers. Doesn't matter if the type matchups work out for you, though. I'll still win. Oh! Ogre Pod! Ogre Pod! No! Sturdy! How do you like that, Seal Heart of Train? Not the kid you bowed in Kitakami, huh? What a. What a battle! Already. I smile throw! <laughs> Stop dying! Okay. Uh-oh. Oh, oh Ogrepod. The extreme speed. Does he react to killing Ogrepod? This is not looking good for me so far. I don't think this magic would have changed much, but. Okay. And then we will grab you. Hopefully, Dragonite doesn't know like that ice spinner move. Yeah, he does not seem to care about defeating Ogrepon. Good to know. Well, I'm glad you helped your buddy, because it's the last thing you're gonna do. Even Lux chosen you over me. It's not fair! It's just not fair! Bruh, you had the first knockout. Like, relax. Porygon Z. But that's a Pokemon I am not familiar with. Incineroar, though, I know, and Incineroar is bad news for Meowskarata. I will probably swap, because Meowskarata could be still be handy. Dark type. Dark is bad against fairy. Alright, so let's bait out fire moves. Well, yeah, on Donald here. I have no idea what Porygon's gonna do. Oh. Or you could use fake Hyper Beam. Excuse me? Well, that's bad news. All right, well, this is definitely bad. We are not in a good place. I'm gonna have to Terra something. I'm not sure what. I just don't know what. Paragon C is out of it right now. That's done. Which is good, because it's never could have done a lot. Alright. Yes, yeah, not a lot. Couldn't have burned it for me? Brain stopped. His own Grim Snarl. Oh. This is all sorts of something.
Against what? Porygon? I'll go for it. That's not gonna matter with the close combat. Let me get this thing out of here. Alright, cool. I might swap out Donald for Meowskarata because of its defense drop. Let's see what happens here. Not bad. Just go down already! How are you still standing after I've thrown everything I have at you? You're gonna tear us something. Oh, his Hydrapple. That makes sense? Okay. I know what I must do. I think we're just gonna keep it in. Really? Super effective? Okay, hold on. I don't need the old me anymore. I've changed! And I'll show you I can change again! I can't yell, I'm not the only one home. But you get the picture. Yeah, he really likes this big apple thing for some reason. Alright, now it's a full dragon. Doesn't really matter if my fairy types are uh, donezo. I don't have any dragon moves. Yeah, the acrobatics kind of came too late there. That was so super effective. How was that? Oh wait, no, it's fighting! It's not dragon, it's fighting! Oh! Okay, there was Rimsnarl. Earth power. Woo! I have to now that I'm fire type. Yeah. See, Aldridge may not survive this, but I think we've got this anyway. The Oscarada can help. Oh, never mind. It's just powerful enough on its own. With my starter and just my best Pokemon. What a duo. Huh? What a shocked face. What? He actually lost? Let's go, guys. <laughs> no. Why? This wasn't supposed to happen. <laughs> no. No, no, no! Way to go! Both of you! That was awesome! Oh, honestly, Crispin, read the room, would you? Way Drayden. Good match, you two. Too bad about the outcome, though, huh? X, champion. Oof. Did not give that time to breathe at all. He was right on it. Look at you, buddy. Way to go! Guess we got a new BB League champion. The Academy's got a prize for people like you who made it all the way to being champion. Here, all yours! A Master Ball. Ooh. Put the Master Ball in your bags. Hey, Kieran. This may not mean much coming from a guy who couldn't beat you, but... I wish you'd go back to having fun with all of this. I get that brain desire to win. I mean, who doesn't like winning? But... Just don't let that desire burn you to a crisp. It's hard to watch. 
Come on, let's all go and win next time. Come again? I won't lose. Next time for sure. I'll I'll win. Next time I'll win. I can try. Rising night. Ugh. Woof. Um, if we might interrupt. Well, first, of course, we want to offer Rising our congratulations for becoming champion. It really is an amazing achievement. Something that should be celebrated. But with all, but with the way things are now, I'm sorry to say that does well complicate matters. We're having a bit of a hard time knowing how we ought to proceed. Proceed with what? Well, think about it for a moment, would you? If Rising is our champion, that means she's the head of our league club. But she's an exchange student. What is our long-term plan here? If she doesn't stick around, there are so many particulars to sort out. Oh, uh, yeah. And of course, if Kieran rejoins the Elite Four after having lost the rank of champion, that would push Crispin out of the ranks. Wait, what? Me? That's bad, isn't it? I'd like to hear from Kieran himself what he would like to do next. Kieran? This is an announcement for the following students. BB League Champion Kieran. Top Elite Four member Drayton. Carmine of Class 3-2. Rising, our exchange student. Miss Pryor and some guests would like to see you. Please proceed to Classroom 1-4 as soon as possible. What could that be about? Now it's not really the time. BB League, League, bleh. BB League Champion Kieran, huh? They're gonna need an update to that. Trade, could you seriously not right now? It's just not right, and certainly not kind. Well, we shouldn't leave Miss Fryer hanging or we'll never hear the end of it. Go on ahead, Rising. We'll meet you there. I'll make sure Crispin come- Oh, Crispin. I'll make sure Kieran comes too, even if I gotta carry him. Oh man. Last for one four, right? Go on ahead, bud. I'll meet you there. Congratulations on becoming champion. But it seems we can't celebrate just yet with everything unsettled. Oh no, this is bad. If I'm on the Elite Four, I can't use the Elite Four space at the Savannah Plaza anymore. Rising. Thank you. Oh, from this angle, I just realized her hair's like got screws. Like it's supposed to look like nuts and bolts and stuff. So bizarre. How are my Pokemon doing? Did they heal me? No. Oh well. We're just gonna have to uh, proceed. Here we are, Miss B. Thank you all for coming. I'm pleased to inform you that some very special guests are here to see you today. They for a tour of the school mere minutes ago, but I believe they'll return soon enough. In the meantime, I'll fill you in on the situation. Please have a seat. Don't mind if I do. These knees are creaking. Oh, please, you're not old enough for that yet. Ah, Rising. I heard you were busy battling your way up to the BB League. But to think you'd make it as far as champion, what a dazzling accomplishment. Thank you so much. Sorry, Miss Briar, but could we leave all that for another time? What's this thing you wanted to tell us about? My apologies. That was insensitive of me. Let me get straight to the today's topic, then. I want all of you here to join me on an expedition to the secluded and mysterious Area Zero. Area Zero? That's the place in Paldea you wanted to visit, right? You got permission? My main goals are to investigate the terrestrial phenomenon and gather samples of the crystals present in the crater. To be honest, I also have one more, ambi one more ambition for this trip. I'm hoping that we can find Terra Terrapagos, legendary Pokemon slumbering in Area Zero. Terrapagos, a legendary Pokemon? 
A rather exciting idea, isn't it? Sup, Gita? Enrico. There you are, Gita. I was just getting the kids up to speed. I do apologize for my tardiness. Miss Gita. Hmm? Champion Rising? I certainly didn't expect to run into you here. Ah, of course. You must be participating in the student exchange program. Rising has got crowned our new BB League champion, too. Your challenge is as brilliant as always, I see. It's truly a wonderful thing. If you'll be going along, then I suppose that bodes well. Is it alright if I explain the situation to the children, Briar? By all means. First, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Gita. I am the chairwoman of the Pokemon League in Paldea. More than a decade ago, the Pokemon League provided support for research on Area Zero, the great crater at the center of Paldea. Once the research was complete, we shifted our duties to monitoring and managing the area. Area Zero is full of mysteries and also danger. Generally speaking, the area is off limits even for research. That being said, recently we've had to confront the possibility that dangerous Pokemon could escape the area. There is a clear need for further research, and quickly. But at our Pokemon League, we've had trouble finding capable personnel, not to mention time, to study Area Zero. So, you reached out to me, as I've been requesting access to the area for quite some time now. I apologize that we were not better equipped to deal with this ourselves. Blueberry Academy has a wealth of highly skilled trainers with well-trained Pokemon. And with Champion Ryzen also on the team, I know I could definitely... I didn't know I could safely initiate a new expedition. This is entirely voluntarily, of course, but it would be very reassuring to have you with us. What do you say, will you join our little team as we explore Area Zero? I don't know... I'm afraid I must insist that you go along, Champion Ryzen. You've been to the depths of Area Zero already, after all. Oh, she knows... Uh, well, I think it's already decided that I'm going. Your support will be very useful as always, Carmine. I appreciate having you on board. Sorry, but I'll pass on this one. The League Club's a whole mess right now. We need my steady hand on the wheel here. Sure. You just can't be bothered to travel all the way to Paladin, can you? Guilty. I'm curious what our mighty ex-champion is thinking, though. I'm going. If there's a legendary Pokemon there, I want to find it and catch it. This time, I won't let this ch I won't let this chance go. Interesting. Then it's decided. It's too bad that Dre will be joining us, but it seems that our team will consist of Carmine, Kieran, Rising, and myself. You have my thanks for your help on this matter. I look forward to the great findings that you will no doubt bring back. I'm grateful for the opportunity, Gita. Leave it to me. My dream of exploring Area Zero is finally becoming a reality. Now it's time to prepare. Let's meet by the bridge at the Academy entrance as soon as we're ready. 